is truck grocery haul time. Happy Vlogmas, day 12 and the final day of 12 days of Christmas for me. Hey y'all, welcome to the channel. I'm Tommy. If you are new to this channel, please go ahead and subscribe, like, share, and comment down below. So I'm about to head out to Sam's Club. I'm also going to the Walmart um, to pick up some things I need to get. I know I have a meal plan for at least a few days. I'm gonna make some chili this week because it's supposed to be cold here in South Carolina and rainy. So I told my husband I was gonna make some chili and he's out driving. So I'm definitely gonna have to freeze some <laughs> and save it for him. So I will see y'all when I get to the store. So y'all, I finally made it to the Sam's Club. I'm about to go in and it seems to be a lot of cars out here so hopefully you know everybody's still spacing themselves out in the store like they're supposed to um, I think the first thing I'm gonna try to hit up though is the tissue I didn't come here for it but I think I'm gonna go ahead and get it so we'll see if they have any also I want to say that um, the reason that I myself um, do my hauls in my prepper pantry is not to say this is what you should buy it's to motivate you to want to prepare for whatever may happen whether it's a loss of a job stores being closed down food shortages anything that could happen uh, weather related whether you know it's snowing you can't get out anything like that you get sick um, your, your family has food that they can prepare because especially if you're the main preparer in your house of cooking meals that they are able to go into the kitchen and find them something that they can prepare for themselves this may not be for everybody so um, I hope that y'all continue to watch I appreciate each and every one of you I thank you for being here on my channel so let me get in this store. I just wanted to say that because I know it's some people like, you know, thinking, well, why are you showing your preps? That's the reason why. And also I have a video that talks about why I started prepping and doing hauls and starting a prepper pantry. Um, is it as big as I want it to be? No, but I'm getting little by little there where I need to be. Okay, let's go. I know this has nothing to do with prepping, but this really sets the mood if this was in the bedroom. I'm just saying. I can barely find the time to sleep. Yeah, I spend my time running around Keeping people pleased But this is my favorite holiday It's a chance to start over new Cause I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you These are the good times with you Baby, this year is just gonna be you and me Hang by the fire and chill Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories So this was all the paper towels and toilet paper that they had in the entire store. Forget about everything else Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas So over in this section over here that I'm about to show you is where they normally would keep the uh, tissue that I get that's in the box. But as you can see, they were completely sold out, so I was left getting the Quilted Northern. We are so grateful to God that we have been able to stock our prepper pantry because this list is shorter than it normally is, so to God be the glory. Good times with you, baby. 
So I haven't bought jelly since the spring because I've been canning my own. And then here's the rice. The parboil is the one that Homestead Heart use. I've never tried it before, but I want to. Um, Y'all, <laughs> this butt uh, rub here, you see what it says, right? So not only do you cook with these, you also use these when you are doing long-term food storage. I thought about World of Apollonia when she said she was walking past and they said, come and get me. But I did not get it. <laughs> I think I might start adding these to my prepper pantry because people are doing the dry milk just in case. Y'all, I finally made it. So I got these right here. Cause this is all they have. You'll see it in the video. The area where I usually get my box, the tissue that's in the box, they were all gone. So this one had 32 jumbo rolls and it's the quilted Northern for $19.98. I did put my prices on them while I was in here. I got these ragu and it's three and they are six dollars and ninety-eight cents. Okay, so I'm gonna do it a little different because I still have a store I have to go into before I take this home. So I got these uh, sausages, they're 42 in here for $9.98. I still have some in the freezer, but I wanted to get some more. Then I got my unsalted butter because I have some things that I want to bake. Then over here, I have bananas, two bunches, and they're $1.39 each. So this right here is my kid's favorite, favorite. And it's $6.28. It's a mayonnaise. It's like a Mexican mayonnaise. Um, my son fell in love with it. His friend who's Mexican turned him on to that. And now my daughter loves it too. So then I got these halos for $5.98. People probably looking at me like I am crazy. But I got these croissants, 12 in a box for $11.98. Um, they go through these. I probably should have got two of these. I'll probably come back next week and get another box. But I can only hold so much. I have a freezer in the garage and refrigerator. It's a freezer refrigerator combo in the garage. And then a deep freezer in the house and then a freezer refrigerator in the house. So I still can only hold so much and I'm full. Then I got these uh, Artisan Sweet Italian Red Onions. I love red onions. These are gonna go in my chili. Um, these are going to go in a lot of things, but these are going to go in the chili this week. And then I also got these green bell peppers for $4.98. These will also go into my chili. Oh, and the onions were $5.98. Then I got the Tostitos pizza rolls. Those were $9.78. My daughter likes these. I eat them when I don't feel like cooking though. 
Um, these beef smoked sausages. I hope I'm holding the camera okay, y'all. These beef smoked sausages are eight eighty-eight, and they have four in a pack. I got some Country Time lemonade. I still have some, but this was six ninety-eight. They last a good bit of time. And then I have the Barilla, two boxes of each elbow spaghetti and panini. So that's basically a dollar a box. So I just went ahead and got that and that was $6.54. I got three packs of the, well, they come three packs of the Smithfield bacon. These were $11.92. Then I got a four pound bag of the triple berry blend. To make smoothies with um this week i gotta do better with my eating so my breakfast is gonna be smoothies this week um this was 8.98 and then i got a pack of the jumbo cook easy peel shrimp which for 17.88 no 17.98 and it's a three pound bag then i got two of the butter breads for 4.58 the little smokies are $5.98 and those are just good as a snack or you can just mix them with some beans if you want then I got two packs of the chicken wings I put them in here Walmart didn't have any chicken wings so this I knew Sam's would probably have it so I got two packs huge packs for like one was $14.68 and one was $14.86 um, and then I gotta put this in here. So I got the uh, Gatorade Zeros. These are good like for when you're working out or just when you're sick. These are better than the other Gatorades. That's what my doctor told me at least. So we've gone through, we probably got about five left in the pack that I have at the house. And then I bought another pack of Aquafina. Well, the Gatorades were $12.78. And the Aquafina was $4.98, y'all. So, y'all, this is my truck haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, it's so much easier doing it this way than to get home and try to stack up. So, now I'm about to put all this stuff in this truck and head to my next store. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. I appreciate y'all. Remember, if you haven't subscribed, please join the family. Um, we do gardening. We do prepper pantries. We do hauls. We cook and all that stuff. Um, yeah. And also like the channel. Share it out. And leave me some comments down below, y'all. Do you like me doing it this way? Or would you prefer me doing it back in the house? It's kind of on the fly of doing it. So I'm just going to do a scan of everything. So happy Vlogmas. Take care. Stay blessed. Remember to love yourself. And remember to go out and spread God's love. Because if you don't love yourself, how can you love anyone else? Switches. So I managed to get it all in here. again i appreciate each and every one of you and remember that if you prepare today you can eat tomorrow tell me tell me bites tell me tell me bites